Hello everybody, we are here in the Nemesis uh, Metaverse for our uh, weekly uh, appointment with the, um, this uh, talk uh, show. Uh, today we will speak with uh, Paola Pinna. Thank you so much for Hello, being here. Thank you. Uh, about uh, um, NFT and crypto art, as uh, she's a well known Italian NFT artist. So, um, thanks a lot again for being here. here. Um, can you please uh, um, introduce yourself and um, let us know more about how did you start with the NFTs? Sure, thank you for having me. Um, I'm Paola Pinna, I'm a 3D artist. Uh, and I've been in the NFT space uh, since uh, early 2021, so like just over one year and a half ago. Um, prior to that, I was just working as an artist and as freelancers. And uh, but now, like I do a lot with NFTs, like collaborations and exhibitions. So um, I'm pretty full in, I'd say. Um, so yes, I've started, I, I sold my first NFT, I think it was April 2021 uh, to Token Angels. Um, so that was like a really good start that kind of set my way up into the space. Um, so I, I was really lucky and from the start, I'd say, and it's been a, an amazing journey so far. And uh, what's your main project you are working on right now? Yeah, so my my main uh, project now is Meta Eden, which is uh, an NFT series of one on one one on one episodes, uh, which I'm meeting on Super Air, uh, and it's a collaboration between me and Flunz. She's also a multidisciplinary artist. She does the writing, like she writes the story, and like I do all the visual and the art. Uh, um, and the concept is like we, we I've created on Unreal this world um, that it's. Um, a kind of Eden, in fact, inhabited by avatars and their pets. Um, and it's very like gaming aesthetics because um, I want this to be a video game in the future. So now it's just like setting up um, this world and like making uh, animations that are sold as episodes. Um, and it's very like spiritually driven. So each episode represents a chakra, which is seven of them in total. And basically it's a journey through the characters and like they way through the highlight um, and their spiritual journey. And also each collector receives one custom avatar that it's going to be featured in the last and finale. So it's pretty fun. <laughs> And uh, I saw you collaborated with Adidas, um, you know, you posted a few things on your social media. How did it go? How, how was the collaboration? Yes, it went very well. So actually Adidas contacted Reason at Art, which is an Italian NFT platform I'm part of, and they have curated this project. And Adidas chose me and Filippo Gisleri to make artworks uh, for the anniversary of the superstars. Uh, it went actually very well because they gave us a lot of creative freedom and uh, it was really fun then to see the artworks displayed in various cities around Europe and uh, YouTube. So uh, I think it was very, very fun, very successful project. And you were speaking about the first uh, NFT sold uh, to Token Angel and that it was a great very good thing for your career for sure and what are the the other i have to say like highlights of mm -hmm. your nft career so far yes um considering that i've been on the space for just over a year i think i've had quite a few highlights especially in terms of exhibiting my work um globally i've exhibited alongside like so many well-known artists um both Italian and internationals, like for Dreamverse, Metaphors in New York, to uh, like working with Mokda for um, Cambi, um, until like uh, this year I've exhibited at Bellum LA. Uh, so I, we had like massive screens, and like it was amazing to see my work um, shown in that in that way. But also like Art Basel and Miami, and like. 
um, even with you, Amelia, like so many cool um, opportunities to exhibit with like very amazing artists as well. Um, I'd say these are their lights, yeah. But also like to be collected as well by amazing collectors such as Talking Angels and Poseidon, because I think that is that is super rewarding to me as an artist to feel like. I am appreciated by people that really know like what they are doing in the space. So, and in general, what are you most proud of in your career as an artist? Not only NFT artist, but in general. Mm -hmm. uh, I'd say I'm proud of the fact that I'm um, getting better and better in my skills, and I think with NFTs a lot, they give me like a huge chance to improve. Um, and experiment more and try new things. Um, so that's what I'm most proud of because I've been doing 3D for just over like three, four years. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm very proud of like the speed of, of how everything is going. Um, but also like being part of a of an amazing community, like that's something I'm really held, held with pride. Uh, it's very, very rewarding. Which program do you use for your artworks? Because it's a question we always receive from the users. Uh, I mostly use Blender as my main software, but I also use Dat Studio and Unreal Engine. So I'd say these three are the main softwares I'm using. I'm also um, currently implementing uh, VR. So I do some things uh, with the headset as well. Um, Oh, so cool. Yeah. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, apart from the, the Chakra uh, project uh, uh, that you wish to be a video game in the future, what are your uh, other future projects you are working on right now? Well, I've just bought a mock-up suit, which basically allows me to like animate my avatars like from just moving, um, which is something I've been waiting for so long. Um, so now finally, um, from next week, I'm going to start doing some more performative pieces, um, like some more fun pieces. Um, and yeah, so definitely going to more like even more so tech driven stuff, uh, experimental stuff, gaming. Um, yeah. I remember everyone that if you want to watch again this uh, this video, if you want to share with your uh, with your friends, it will be possible in like a few days on cryptonomist.ch, which is the 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 the, the company uh, collaborating with Nemesis for uh, this talk show, and so you will be able to see also this video with Paula again. So thank you so much, Paola, for your time mm -hmm. and uh, congrats for everything. Good luck. Thank also. you so much. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs>